Hello, I'm Jill Roberts. I'm the infection control nurse for care homes in Hartlepool and Stockton. Just to let you know what I've been doing since COVID-19 hit the care homes and they've had many outbreaks. We've been coming in with advice and support. At the moment I'm delivering training. Um, I give support over the phone to all the care homes and care home staff. I work closely alongside uh, Hartlepool Borough Council and Stockton Borough Council and the CCGs and the CQC Commission and Inspectors. Um, we're working very closely together to provide safe, clean and supportive care during this pandemic. Hi, I'm Claire Brooks. I'm a returner to Infection Prevention and Control. I'll be working with Jill Roberts and the Infection Prevention Team at North Tees to come into the nursing homes to help support with tra training and information. But we do know that um, as we ease the lockdown outside, we might think that we ease the lockdown in the care homes, but actually it's just more important today to be able to put your aprons and gloves on and your face visors and your face mask the same way as you did at the beginning of COVID-19. What I'm asking you to be is PPE safety officers. So you're the eyes and ears of the care home, so that if you observe anybody not taking the aprons and gloves and the face mask and the face visors on correctly, then you can have a quick word with them and say this is the correct way to do it. So you'll be all classified as PPE safety officers um, and I'm going to do a quick presentation and after the presentation we'll get some uh, volunteers uh, to come and put the apron and gloves on and then we'll observe you take any aprons, gloves, your face visors and your, your masks off appropriately so that you're not going to contaminate yourself because that's the most important part, we don't want you to contaminate yourself. Um, so uh, Jill Roberts, the Infection Prevention Control Nurse, um, has been very supportive in helping us deal with it and battle. Um, without Jill, the resources um, that are available that I wouldn't have been able to find, wouldn't have been available for us to use within the home. Um, and obviously that has promoted and supported all the residents and staff within the home following correct procedures.